So that is our starting position. So our starting position always has to start with 100%, with fullness. And this is another revelation that I had to get for myself. When I got saved, the way I was taught, I start at zero, and I'm working up. I'm trying to earn, earn, earn. You know, I try to fast. I try to pray. I try to do all of these things, read the Bible, do all of these things to earn it. Maybe God will be happy with me one day. You know, and every time I would mess up, um, I would hide from God. I would literally feel like, okay, God, you know, like a week would go by, like, okay, you're not too angry with me anymore. That's the lie that I used to believe. Why? Because I was always taught that if, so for example, like I would have a stomach pain, I would be, I was told, go into your room and figure out what sin you committed. Repent and then beg God and maybe, maybe that stomach, will go, stomach pain will go away. As a child, this is what I was brought up. And so for me, it was really hard to adjust to change that uh, belief system, but I, by mind renewal, I no longer believe that. Why? Because it is no longer I that live, it's Christ living through me. So it's His righteousness, it's His forgiveness, it's His life. And so my stuff doesn't matter. What matters is what He did. And when Jesus comes before the Father, is the same thing as you and I come before the Father. Why? Because we are in Christ. We are in Him. We are hidden in Him. And we don't have a covenant with God. God has a covenant with Jesus. And we're in Him. That means we have a perfect covenant with the Father. And because God cannot break His covenant with Jesus, if you're in Christ... God cannot break a covenant with us. But it goes back to believing or unbelieving. Are you a believer or unbeliever? If you're an unbeliever, you're not in Christ, therefore you're, you, you don't have anything with God or Christ. If you're a believer, you're in Christ, and now you're in covenant with God through Christ. And so this is the best deal. Think about it. Jesus paid the price for everything. Everything that we've ever done, everything... All of our messes, everything Jesus paid the price for. And he says, I have this amazing covenant with my father. That is the best covenant that you can have. And he says, if you believe, you and I will become one. And now through me, you have the covenant with the father. But Jesus is the one that has the covenant with the father. And so... We have an amazing deal. Like, there's nothing else. The devil or this world, nothing else comes close to what Jesus provided for us.